Carnage is on the loose again, and the authorities are unable to track his seemingly random attacks. But deranged minds think alike, so who better than Deadpool to track down a serial-killing psychopath? Once he'd opened himself to the madness of the universe giving him clues, Deadpool was led to Carnage hiding out in an abandoned housing development in Tulsa. He got the jump on him and attacked, but just as he was about to finish the job, Carnage's old pal Shriek showed up to save his hide. Literally. Now it's Deadpool's neck on the line, and he's outnumbered. I'm gonna ask you one last time, sweetness. And if I don't like the answer, I'm gonna get real nasty with you. How you find me? It wasn't that hard. I just followed the clues. Ain't no clues. Oh, come on. Be faithful to your backwoods upbringing. Don't you mean twerk no clues? Either way, that was the wrong answer. What do you want me to say? Let me put it in terms you'll understand. You're kinda crazy and my kinda crazy are like kissing cousins. And I can track the, I don't know, patterns. Like your cousin and my cousin were tootaloo'ing to each other. Like yodelers at a hog calling contest. There ain't no patterns. Everything I do, from here on out, is random. I can't be stopped, can't be caged, can't be tracked. My every action is a tribute, an offering, to the almighty... Dollar? Chaos. And it don't matter how you found me. I'm gonna make sure you never bother anyone again. And I'm gonna make you suffer. Yeah. Do, do you like music? I think pain is causing this old boy to hallucinate or something. Maybe you should go ahead and put him out of his misery. Do it, baby. It's always nice to get to know your victim before you ice them. See, I figure you're the kind of guy that likes his grand old Opry jams. Might be nice to broaden your horizons. Try this for example. What the hell? It's called dubstep. See, I work with your brother or daddy or whatever he is, Venom, and he hates the stuff. So, in anticipation of our little meeting, I loaded some illegally downloaded tunes onto my MP3 player. Because you, you don't deserve sonic torture that's been paid for. Leave him alone! Hey, uh, Shriek, right? I get where you're coming from. You're excited to have me all to yourself for a few. You've been giving me the let's wrestle eyes ever since you tore my face off. This might kill the mood, though. Ugh, so embarrassing. Nice trick. If you'd have done your homework, though, you'd realize me and my dear old dad are different creatures. Sonics might hurt me, but they don't keep me down. I thought that might be a problem. So that's why I brought these incendiary grenades. Fire in the hole! Uh, uh fire in the hole? Looks like your weapons let you down, son. Should have bought American. Please? Oh yeah, that's right. I almost forgot I rigged these to a remote detonator. Now fire in the hole! <laughs> Those old grenade gags never get old. And Carnage fell for it twice in so many issues. I love this guy. Oh yeah! Deranged mass murderer, one. Other deranged murderer, nothing. Who's got two recently regenerated thumbs and just nuked Carnage? This! Huh? <coughs> what? They can fly? That's no fair. If I had a hot levitating girlfriend, I'd run away too. Cop a feel while flying the f friendly. <sighs> a freak fire in Oklahoma yesterday destroyed an abandoned housing development. The community was one of many similar sites left empty after economic downturns. While the case of the fire is unknown, authorities have not ruled out arson. Excuse me, a little help here? I've got a storage locker here full of spare uniforms, automatic weapons, and enough ammo to choke the NRA. I keep little caches like that scattered all over the place, but I can't seem to get my key to work. Um, 
Let me just look up your account, Mr. Uh, Leroy St. Germain Dagnasty. In other news, the series of random brutal murders attributed to the serial killer Carnage continues. This time, the mass murderer struck at a Chicagoland pawn shop, taking the lives of five individuals. With no readily apparent pattern to the murder spree, authorities are at a loss. Oh. Oh? I see the problem. The problem? It looks like you missed a few payments. Yeah, but that wasn't my fault. I was traveling through the multiverse, killing off evil versions of myself. There's got to be some leniency for that, right? I'm really sorry, Mr. Dynasty. That's Dagnasty? Yes. Well, when you missed your third payment, we auctioned off the contents of your locker. Who? Who bought my stuff? Let's see, let's see... Doverton! Here we are. Not that any of my gear does me any good if I don't figure out where to find Carnage. Come on, Zeitgeist! Give me a sign! First things first, of course. Just gotta convince this guy to hand over all my stuff. But really, how hard could that... be? Deadpool! Her Finally! I've been waiting for you! I knew it! I knew we'd find each other! Yeah, uh, here I am! At, uh... Last! Why don't we talk inside, huh? Great idea, Deadpool. Or, can I call you Wade? Deadpool is fine. Sure thing. Either way, we've got lots to talk about, huh? Well, this is uncomfortable. So, are you like my greatest fan or something? Because I met my biggest admirer and it didn't end up going so well for him. You've got it all wrong. I'm not a fan. In fact, up until a few weeks ago, I'd never heard of you. I mean, I like superheroes, I guess. But I've always been more interested in, you know, real heroes. Yeah, but you're wearing my costume. Oh, this? I'm not wearing this because I want to be you. I was just trying to enhance the collection. All right, I came in here to gank you nice and quiet so I could get my stuff back. But you've officially creeped me out. What the hell are you talking about? I didn't understand it either. Not at first. But when I bought that storage locker, it was as if my eyes were opened. I saw the patterns. Recognized the signs. I knew it was my duty to help you. Together, we can stop Carnage once and for all. I know where Carnage is going even if he doesn't know himself. And I've always been connected to it. I should have known because of my last name, Doverton. Carnage attacked the town of Doverton. And there are tons of other connections. Okay, so you're nuts, that much is obvious. But somehow you're on the same wavelength as me and Carnage. That's right. First things first, take off that uniform. There aren't enough unstable molecules in the world to handle those stretch marks. Then, tell me where to find Carnage. Relax, babe. I stole this sweet set of wheels. You worry too much. Maybe you don't worry enough. If that Deadpool freak can find us once, there is nothing saying he can't find us again. I say he can't find us again. That was a fluke. This guy just stumbled onto our hideout. He can't find us if we keep moving randomly. I hope you're right. Don't you trust me? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> but that's why I like you. Uh, breaker, breaker. Can I get a come on back from the hick with the alien symbiote? Come back, Carnage. I'm right here with you, so why don't you just pull over and let's talk this out like a couple of gentlemen. How the hell? Where is he? First of all, sweetheart, you're looking in the wrong direction. Second of all, you should... Really teach your boyfriend not to tailgate. Buckle up. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! What? Shriek! Uh, Shriek, baby! Aw, oh, yeah! Bridging! Did Big Bad Deadpool wake your widow psychotic suicide girl? Don't worry, maybe you'll get conjugal visits. In hell! Alright, dumbass. You wanna poke the Komodo? You got it! I'm gonna heal you out of there, like a crawdaddy from its shell. Oh, 
Oh, hey, cut it out. You're dripping on... Let's do this thing. Carnage versus Deadpool. Round two. I think you mean Deadpool versus Carnage.